Hi. Last week we talked about the Greeks and the Hebrews and the Eskimos from the curriculum, Why Do Bad Things Happen? And I wanted to talk a little bit about why I picked this curriculum. So I want, it goes into different sections and it's really important that we understand where we come from so that we know where we're going to. This also helps us redefine our own beliefs. So it's in different sections and the overall concept I wanted to share with you was uh, the people that wrote it, they said that this helps you learn your own story and that as religious liberals, we have been maybe overly conscious of not wanting to teach answers to theological questions. But this uh, cautions unnecessary if we give our own viewpoint. If we say, in my experience, I really feel, my life tells me, and now I believe. So this sharing is, I'm not imposing it on you, but it reveals that we ha all have spiritual depths and it gives you guys, the kids, able to, you feel free to have your own answers and be different and to write your own story. But it's very important that we know where we came from and all past beliefs so that we can redefine and know where we're going. So it's in different sections. The first section is why do bad things happen? Some people think it's because God or gods did something very wrong in the beginning or people. The second unit is some people think it's because you were bad in a past life or you're being punished in this life. The third unit is some people think it's because of wrong thinking. The fourth unit, it's because of evil spirits. The next one is it's because you upset the harmony of the universe. Now, a lot of Unitarians are very comfortable with that concept. And the next one says it's because you were bad or God is punishing you. Uh, another one, it's because an evil force is fighting against a good force. And that is very common in a lot of our TV and movie themes. Another one, it, it, the next unit says it's because of fate. Uh, the next one is it's just the way the world is. And this is a very Unitarian concept. The next one, we will always be searching and wondering and then how do we make good things happen? 